Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan voiced hope that conflicts in the Middle East could come to an end through collaboration with recently elected U.S. President Donald Trump. Trump was elected the 47th President of the United States on Wednesday, an extraordinary comeback for a former president who refused to accept defeat four years ago, sparked a violent insurrection at the U.S. Capitol, was convicted of felony charges and survived two assassination attempts. In our phone conversation with the elected President of the United States, Mr. Trump, we congratulated him on his historic election victory and drew attention to the massacres in Gaza and Lebanon, Erdogan said. We expect our dear friend Trump to abandon the erroneous policies of the previous administration in his second term as president. We sincerely believe that Mr. President will do his part in ending the wars, and we sincerely hope so. Amerika'nın seçilmiş başkanı Sayın Trump'la yaptığımız telefon görüşmesinde hem kendisini tarihi seçim zaferinden dolayı tebrik ettik hem de Gazze ve Lübnan'daki katliama dikkat çektik. Değerli dostum Trump'tan ikinci başkanlık döneminde eski yönetimin hatalı politikalarını terk etmesini bekliyoruz. Sayın Başkan'ın savaşları sonlandırma noktasında elini taşın altına koyacağına yürekten inanıyor. Bunu da samimiyetle temenni ediyoruz. Pakistanis reacted largely with optimism to the election of Donald Trump as U.S. President, as anticipation about who will be appointed as the special envoy for the region grows. Political analyst Zara Kuro said Pakistan could face trouble if Zalmai Khalilzad is chosen as the Afghanistan-Pakistan special envoy. One hears rumors that it might be Zalmai Khalilzad. If that is the case then he is very much a hawk on Pakistan, Kuro told the Associated Press. However, it is important to understand that Trump is fundamentally transactional. It's about what he can get from you at what price. If he gets what he wants he will be willing to do business with anyone in Pakistan, he added. Meanwhile, stock market analyst Jibran Sarfraz welcomed Trump's win as, his last tenure was good for Pakistan. We expect the relation to be further improved if he adopts a soft policy and provides a business-friendly environment, said Sarfraz. Local resident Kershid Remini also expressed his delight in a Trump administration. It will have a positive impact on the whole world. Trump's win is a good omen, he said. Who is going to be the special envoy? to the AFPAC region. I mean, one hears rumors that it might be Zalmay Khalilzad, and if that is the case, then he's very much a hawk on, on, on Pakistan. So that could spell uh, some trouble going forward. However, I think that it's important to understand, at least in my view, that Trump is fundamentally transactional. Uh, it's about what he can get from you at what price. So um, a lot of people here feel that you know, he may not want to play ball with the current uh, political government. He may play hardball. I will uh, certainly accept that. That's his style. But I think that if he gets what he wants, he'll be willing to do business with anyone in Pakistan. I don't think that there's going to be any kind of an outsized impact. I mean, certainly, you know, as we saw with the last Trump administration, there is always a baseline increase in racism in the United States when someone like Trump wins. But, um, you know, as they say, a rising tide lifts all boats, right? So um, it's not, I don't think that the Pakistani community is going to be specifically targeted out, uh, uh, by Trump supporters or, or in, in that case. But of course, if there's a general rise in racism, then that affects all uh, ethnic, linguistic uh, and racial minorities in the United States.
ट्रम्प की जो भी मोमेंट शुरू हुई है उसको पाकिस्तान के सभी हलकों ने और चाहे वो सियासी हलके हैं सफारती हलके हैं और तमाम ही लोगों ने उनकी आमद उनकी नोमतखीब होने पर सेलेक्ट होने पर खैर मकदम किया है और बड़ी अच्छी निगाह से देखा है तो मैं समझता हूँ इसके मुस्तबिल में भी बड़े अच्छे असर मुरतब होंगे और पूरी दुनिया में एक मस्बत मैसेज है कि ट्रम्प का आना खुशाइन है एशिया के लिए ख़ास तौर पर जो पॉलिसी बनाएंगे अगर सॉफ्ट पॉलिसी बनाएंगे तो पाकिस्तान और यूएस के ताल्लुक भी बेहतर होंगे और मजीद आने वाले दिनों में जो है जो लास्ट लास्ट जो टेंडोर था इनका वो भी अच्छा गुजरा था अब हम एक्सपेक्ट करते हैं कि पाकिस्तान और यूएस के ताल्लुक मज़ीद बेहतर हो सकते हैं अगर ये जो जो इनकी पॉलिसी है एशियन पर ख़ास तौर पर इनको सॉफ्ट करते हैं और जो बिज़नेस फ्रेंडली इन्वायरमेंट प्रोवाइड करते हैं 